there are many different ways to obtain permanent resident status in the United States. The two most common ways immigrants obtain permanent resident status is either through a family member or through employment. Some other ways you may be able to obtain a green card are through asylum and refugee status or by winning the diversity visa lottery. For immigrants who are trying to obtain a green card through a family member, it is necessary to understand that while the United States government values the importance of keeping families together, it also has limits on which family members may be granted a green card through a relative. It's equally important to note that the U.S. government makes distinctions between relatives of U.S. citizens and relatives of lawful permanent residents. If you are the parent, spouse, sister, brother, or child of an American citizen, you may obtain permanent residence in the United States. You may also obtain permanent residence in the U.S. if you are the unmarried child or spouse of a lawful permanent resident. The spouse, parent, or child of a U.S. citizen is a qualifying relative. The aunt or uncle of a U.S. citizen cannot be a qualifying relative because USCIS has not authorized these kinds of relatives to apply for a green card. The petitioner in the family-based green card process is your U.S. citizen or lawful permanent resident relative who submits the I-130 form on your behalf. Along with the I-130 petition form, your petitioning relative will submit documentation of their U.S. citizen or permanent resident status. To prove citizenship, they may submit a U.S. birth certificate, a certificate of naturalization, or a valid U.S. passport. Your relative will also need to submit the supporting documentation proving his or her family relationship to you. Obviously, this will vary depending on what the family relationship is and on the specific circumstances of each relationship. If you and your relative are both living outside the United States, you will file the petition with the nearest U.S. consulate that processes visa petitions. If the petitioner is living inside the U.S., he or she will send the visa petition to the U.S. CIS office servicing their area. Three groups of beneficiaries qualify as immediate relatives. The first group of immediate relatives is the parents of U.S. citizens, but only if the U.S. citizen is age 21 or older. The second group of immediate relatives is the spouses of U.S. citizens. The third group of immediate relatives is the unmarried children under the age of 21 of U.S. citizens. The relative of a lawful permanent resident is never considered an immediate relative by U.S. CIS. Parents of permanent residents do not qualify. Only U.S. citizens may petition for a parent to obtain a green card. The petitioner must also be 21 years of age or older. If you are the parent of a child born in the U.S. and that child is still a minor, your wait time may be quite long. You can qualify as the parent of a U.S. citizen if you are the natural mother or father, the stepmother or stepfather, or the adoptive mother or adoptive father of a U.S. citizen. If you were married at the time of the child's birth and are the natural parent of the person who is now the U.S. citizen, you shouldn't have much trouble proving your relationship. You will need to submit your marriage certificate and the child's birth certificate with the child's name and the names of you and your spouse with the I-130 petition. This will establish your eligibility to qualify in this category. You can find out more information about other options by visiting immigrationdirect.com.